Hello, good morning. Welcome to Sarojini Smart Learning. So, thank you for watching my videos and supporting me. And uh, for the last few, few episodes, we are doing videos on basic mathematics for the primary section. So, in this episode, we are dealing with divisions of weight. Okay. So, this is measurement of weights. In this, we are going to deal with divisions. Okay. So, in the previous episodes, we have covered with the additions, covered with subtractions, covered with multiplications and in this episode, we are dealing with divisions. So, I am going to write some numbers. How we are going to divide, we will check it out. Okay. You can see a question on the board. So, divide 120 kgs to 525 grams by 5. Now here again, just like multiplication, splitting the grams and kilograms, then doing this one part. So, one part is 120 kg, 525 grams is divided by 5. This is one method of writing. You can get cancelled. 5 times 1, 5 times 2 is 10. Out of 12, 10 goes and 2 remain. So this 2 and 0 is 20. So 5 for the 20. So this many cages already we got. Done. Again, 5 times 1 is 5. 5 times 0 is 0. From 2, if 0 goes 2 left, that becomes 25. 5 times 5, that is gram. So the answer is 24 grams. So 24 kg is 105 grams. This is my method of doing. In the regular method, what we will do is cages and grams. 24 kg, 100, sorry, 120 kg, no? 120 kg and 525 grams is divided by 5. Okay? So, how are you going to do? 5 to the 10. Now you left 2 with a 0, 5 for the 20, so now the cages part is over. Now bring down this 5 down, this is 5, already this is 0. So 5 ones are 5, 0, next number bring down that is 2. In 5 table 2 one comes, so 5 zero is a 0, again 2 left with a 5. So 5 ones are, no, this is 5. That becomes 25. 5 times 5 is 25. This will zero. So here is the answer. Nothing but 24 kgs and 105 grams. Suppose here instead of 2, 525 kgs, if it is less than the given divisor, again you can take 1 kg to that side and make it 1000 more and you can do it. Okay. So first thing is directly cancellation method and the second method is division method whichever you want you can take cancellation method or division method if you are good at cancellation you directly do without uh, going for a division and long division method i'll give one more example the question is 486 kg 288 grams divided by 6 this is the question okay now we'll check so my method is 486 kg, 288 grams is divided by 6. 6 times 1, here 6 is 48 will go, remaining 6. 6 ones are 6, so 81 kg is the first part of the answer. Next, 6 fours are 24 will go, 6 fours are 24, here 4 left. 4 and 8 is 48. 6 eights are 48 grams. So the final answer is 81 kg and 48 grams. So if you make it 6 parts of this question, each part is 81 kg, 48 grams will come. Now if I check in a long division method, kgs and grams, so 486 kg, 
288 grams if I take divided with 6. So this is first part. Second part method I am going to show you. So 6 times of 8 is 48. This is 0, 0. Bring down 6. 6 ones are 6. Again 0. So now the case part is over. Next if you bring down 2. Now do you think 2 will go in 6 table? No. So we put a 0 here. That is 2 and 8. So 6 times of 4 is 24. You will have to 4 and bring down this 8 down. So 6 8s are 48. So this is the answer. But you may say that sir, here in the long division 81 kg 0 48 grams came but here 81 kg only 48. So as I told, 1000 grams make 1 kilogram. So 48 where you write 4a and the place will be 0. If you don't write 0, so nothing will happen. So 81 kg and 48 grams or 0 48 grams is the right answer for this one. So with this, I hope you understood the division concepts in uh, kgs and grams. And I am going to explain a word problem also. We will see. Now. So, here I gave a word problem in division. So, you have to understand it and get the answer. Now, the question is 5 kgs of sweets, total how many kgs of sweet is there? 5 kg. Okay. Is equally distributed among 50 students. These 5 kgs of sweets equally distributed among 50 students. Suppose, if 1 kg, there are 5 kgs, if you divide between 5 students, so 1 kg, 1 kg, 1 kg, 1 kg and 1 kg, we can do it easily. But there are not 5 students, there are 50 students who are there. So how we are going to divide and how much each child will get is the question. So what I will do, this number seems more than this number. So, I am converting 5 kg as 5000 grams as 1 kg is equal to 1000 grams. So, 5 kg means 5000 grams. Okay. So, this is the main part. Now, this 5000 grams will be distributed among 50 students. So, each one, that is one student will get how much? That is the point. This is the question. So here, now for 50 it is given, we are decreasing the number of students. It is coming for 1. So the number of grams also will decrease here. Decreasing the word division. So this is a division problem. How you are going to divide? 5000 grams is divided between 50. So 50 times 1 is 50, 0, 0. Bring down this 0 down. So again 50 zero is a 0. This is 0. Again bring down one more 0. Again 50 zero is a 0. The final answer is 0. That is nothing but 100 grams. So that means each student will get 100 grams. So in other words, if you don't want to go in a long division method, 5000 grams is divided between 50 students. So 0 and 0 will get cancelled. You remain with 500 by 5. 5 1 times. 5 1 times is 5 and 0 0 which is equal to 100 grams. So how you are going to how much does each student get? Each student get 500 grams. So with this, so we conclude, with this we conclude measurement of weights. In the, in the first episode we did with additions, in the second episode we did subtractions, then multiplication and this is division. So first you have to read the question, whether it is direct question or a word problem, then after that analyze it, then do it. There are two methods I am showing. One is cancellation method, one is long division method. Whichever the method you like, that you can adopt it. And not only with this number, you can take, you can take some other numbers also and practice. So if you get any doubt, write down in my comment box. Definitely, I will uh, give you the right answer in the right time. Or you can send me through WhatsApp also. 
hope you understood this session and you are enjoying with all my videos and please share to all of your friends and relatives also whenever uh, possibility is there so that they can avail all types of basic mathematics right now. Okay, have a nice day. Thank you.